summarization of your emotions right now. Uh, a very interesting game where you go from a very big high to a, to a, to a low at the end of the game. Um, personally, I think just like we're proud of how far we went in the tournament, but definitely disappointed because we were up by two goals and we let the other team back, we let Williams Smith back into the game. So just like definitely disappointed right now and sad because <laughs> our season's over. But that's my story. <laughs> Uh, Gabby, that first goal you scored some really good individual skill there. Did, had you identified something through your scouting and or film work that uh, you know you really forced them to defend a lot in the first half, mm -hmm. and that's that's something that they, they haven't had to do an awful lot of. Um, I think that we had a really good scout, but I think what it comes down to is everyone showing up, um, everyone giving it their all, regardless of what we know about them. Um, it comes down to everyone deciding that they want to play well, and that's why we were able to get them to defend us. Um, it's not really about what we know about them because every game is different. Mm -hmm. Your speed in general seemed to give them a lot of trouble in the first half. Uh, again, is that something that came from the scouting report that you felt like you had a little bit of an edge there? They've been fast since they got here. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't think so. Um, I think that I think we all just came to play how we play, um, and I think that. If we're fast, we're fast. If they're fast, they're fast. Um. <laughs> Coach, uh, two nil at halftime. It's a great position to be in, and uh, anybody who watches or has played this game understands a two nil lead is usually pretty good. But what were your words at halftime to keep everybody on an even keel and, and make them understand there's still work to be done? Well, whatever those words are, I gotta make sure I never use them again. So. <laughs> Soccer's a game, I mean, the third goal will usually decide games. I mean, we scored the third one, it's probably it's probably done, but uh, you know, two nothing, you feel good, but you gotta win, you gotta win two halves, and we won the first half, and we weren't able to win the second half. Um, but, you know, I don't know. I mean, this, this, is, this is a player-led team, and uh, hopefully coach mentors and trying to help them find the ways they wanna go. This group, they, they, they lead themselves. We, we don't have to spend a whole lot of time hand pulling. Okay. The first goal of William Smith did score uh, for any of you. There seemed to be a bit of confusion on the ball there, but one of the players was in an offside position, kind of looped back outside, and next thing you know, somebody's bursting in and, and scoring. Uh, did, did you see Did you see what I saw? That just seemed to be a little bit of confusion with your back line because of the offside position? Definitely think there was a little bit of a miscommunication on our marks. I think at that point we had tried shifting a few people around and I think we just got caught off guard on that one. So definitely was a miscommunication on the back line part and the midfield. So. Anything else anybody wanted to ask? Um, is there anything, um, I know obviously not um, a happy moment after this game, but is there anything um, that you'll take away from this game that um, you can just think about to improve on going into next season? I think we learned a lot from this game, how important it's going to be to play a full 90 minutes of every single game. And I think going into next season, we want to make sure this never happens again. I also think something else we can learn is like don't doubt ourselves because we came in here being technically the lowest ranked team, but we had a very hard schedule this season and just this definitely proved to us that we compete with the highest level teams in the nation and we should never like be backing down or nervous for any game that we're going up against or any team we're going up against. I think if anything, it just made us all more proud and more proud of ourselves and how we got here and um, wanting more going forward. Yeah, it's the 13th tournament team that we've played either from last year or this year during the season. So, um, and so I don't think we're afraid of anybody and uh, we, we go forward and we attack. I mean, that's just what we do. That's just who we are. And uh, you know, hopefully we'll be able to use those. And I want to know what kind of foundation we've left for next year, to be honest. Um, I'm excited about what you guys have done. Okay. Any more questions? Okay. I think we're good. <laughs>